What do you think would happen if you tripled your protein intake? Does it not matter as long as the calories are the same? Does it increase fat loss? Does it increase muscle gain? Now I know the world over, the recommendations are usually 40 to 60 grams per day, pretty much every country in the world. But they did a study on this um, in the US and they basically tripled the protein for one group of women to find out what would happen. So there's two groups. One group was given 56 grams of protein per day, a little bit more than the RDA, but the other group was given 157 grams. So basically tripling the protein to find out exactly what would happen. And the results, my friends, are very interesting and they are completely different. This was an eight week trial and they were coached by an IFBB bikini competitor. So they were training throughout the whole eight weeks as well. At the end of eight weeks, get this, fat loss in the high protein group, they lost 2.4 pounds of fat. The lower protein group only lost 1.7 pounds of fat. Lean mass, very interesting. The high protein group was up five pounds and the low protein group was only up one pound of lean mass. So the body composition differences were wildly different depending on the protein intake. This is why for me, calories are king and they're always going to be king. You cannot get around calories in, calories out if you want to lose fat. You can't get past that. However, I would put protein intake as like 1B, not even number two. Calories are 1A, protein is 1B because it's not just about weight loss. We don't want weight loss per se. What we want is body composition changes. We want fat down dramatically and we want our lean body mass up so that we actually look better when the diet is over. Almost forgot to say, this is despite the high protein group eating 400 more calories. This was extra food on top. So they were eating about 100 grams extra protein a day, which comes to 400 more calories. Bottom line, when it comes to weight loss, you can say calories are king, fine. When it comes to body recomposition, calories and protein are king.